Hello guys, this is the Sorter Guy here, and welcome back to some Sorter news that has come up yesterday. Finally, we have some news about what is going to be happening on 2018. Now, first of all, there is not much, but, however, we're gonna get the next game update 5.7, which is called Legacy of the Creators. We're gonna get it on January 23rd, so that is two weeks away. Uh, so it's kind of like, it, it, this is gonna be uh, a short, but probably more specific uh, about the storyline uh, patch. So, so just let's get into what we're gonna get on Game Update 5.7, which is gonna be called Legacy of the Creators. Now we're gonna have a new Operation Moss. Uh, I think it's Kiva, I, I don't know how to pronounce it, but obviously we're gonna get Skiva, and I think on either February or March uh, we're gonna get the last boss as well, and we will have the full operation uh, finally. Uh, but not just that, obviously these are gonna be available, like the Skiva operation boss fight is gonna be available on story and veteran mode. And also we're gonna have returning companions. Now, we have Risha and Corso and also Andronicus returning. However, these are gonna be class specific. Now, this is the things that I think the developers decided to bring because uh, I think I'm just gonna go for a little bit of explanation why they decided to go for class specific. Now, in case if you did not know, class specific means Risha and Corso, obviously, they are coming from the smuggler storyline. So, other players, so for example, a Sith warrior or uh, an agent cannot get Risha and Corso. Same goes to Andronicus. Only the Inquisitors have a chance to get Andronicus back. So these are just gonna be class specific storylines that for example, probably they, they going to talk uh, about what is going to be happened or what happened. And I think this is really, really good because let's just remember at the very beginning on game update 5.0, so, or just uh, 4.0 with Knights of the Fallen Empire launched. Uh, I think it's fair to say when a lot of companions are returning, uh, of course, we expected to get all of them in one character. However, th some of the some of the companions are not fitting into certain amount of uh, of your character choices, or if you're a role player, probably you don't want to go in, for example, for uh, uh, I don't know, like uh, East Sign, for example, or like Temple, run a Temple, for example, that you don't want to go with uh, I don't know for a smuggler, but. Uh, I think it's fair to say that uh, I think this is gonna be, I think, some kind of class story as well. Like, uh, probably they, we're going to remember what we've done, or uh, some similar stuff, that, or what is going to be happening in the future, or maybe some other things that we're talking about. Obviously, we got a new Karna Market Pack, since it's a, a, a new patch, so obviously we're going to get a Karna Market Pack. And various box fixes slash updates. Uh, pretty much that's it. So I uh, like nothing else to talk about uh, what fixes or updates. Uh, there is no specific about that. And obviously we're gonna get returning companions this year. As Eric some kind of teased about it. So we're gonna have uh, uh, except to get additional companion uh, returnings. Uh, a new flashpoint and more. So I think it's fair to say we are three patches away for getting 6.0. Now this is game update 5.7 starting really early on January 23rd. Uh, I believe yet last year as well uh, we get the first patch. So January 23rd was the time I think we got the, a new patch. Now. There is going to be three more patches after that. I think there is going to be one more. So game update 5.8, probably 5.9, but I'm not, I, I don't think that's going to happening. I think we're going to get 5.8, but after that, I think we're going to get 6.0. Because on 5.8, we're going to get obviously some returning companions and the last boss for, uh, for the guns from machines. But after that... There's gonna be open worlds. Probably we're gonna add on Game Update 5.8 the new Flashpoint, which will lead us to the main storyline for the expansion. I think this is how it's going to go. 
Uh, I'm just uh, like thinking about in terms of uh, previous years or just experience how, how it went but it looks interesting I'm looking forward to for example finally level up uh, my sm uh, my inquisitor I think my inquisitor is level 70 uh, however I did not done the Knights of the Fallen Empire slash eternal throne story however I did not level up my uh, uh, gunslinger so it's probably time to level up because we don't know what is going to be happening and obviously I'm playing on my uh, Jedi Knight mainly but I'm not gonna get any of these companions so there's not gonna be any story for me other than just the operation itself so I don't think there's gonna be big of a deals in this patch I think again they're just going to fix a lot of stuffs but after that we're gonna get some uh, new flashpoints and stuff like that I think this is how it's going to go and uh, Probably on the summer or something like that, we're gonna get the expansion. So that was it for this one. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Finally, some SWOTOR news. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>